with Chi. Um, life with Chi. Um, I've done, haven't done a video in a long time, so um, it's, it's never too late. People have been asking me to do a sneaker collection video. Um, I've just been putting it off, you know, but you guys have been asking, so I wanted to give it. I'm not trying to do this in any form of bragging or boasting or any of the following. People have just wanted to see my collection, so I figured why not show it? And let's get into it. So the first sneaker I have is a pair of Vans. And here they are. Um, these are customs. Um, these, uh, I've, I've made these in high school on the Vans website. Um, I love the laces. They kind of look like um, Good Burger. That they give me that kind of vibe. Um, just like an old like diner. I thought they were just really cool, so I had to had to make them. The next pair I have are the Sean Watherspoon Adidas. I hope I pronounced his last name right. Um, I love these. They're so dope. So I had to get them. The next pair I have are the Babesa Adidas Superstar Collaboration. I got these this weekend um, from Social Status. Um, they're in Pittsburgh. Um, they're amazing. Um, I love everybody over there. Uh, I, I, I Like I saw them sitting there. And I had to get them. I originally saw them on, I think it was Goat. And I got them like under resale. So, yeah. The next pair I have are the Rick Owens. Um, I have the low pair. I got these, uh, I think, June, uh, June or July. It was just like a grail for me as a stylist. And just, I, I love how, how there's so many ways you can style them and the looks you can create with them. So it was just like a, a big deal for me to be able to, to get them. The next pair I have are the Easy Foam Runner. <laughs> I love these shoes with all of my heart. Now, um, you know, it's, it's to each his own, but for me, I thought they were so cool. Um, I think Kanye's a genius with his vision um, and his form of creative expression, so I just had to get them. As you can see, they're like, you know, they're worn. A little bit um but i love them the next pair i have are the jordan one low se in the pink and black colorway i got these on finish line last summer um i think they were like 90 dollars, and these are kind of going over for like resale and i just thought they were cute to be honest with you i've only worn them what was it how many times have i worn maybe like twice t two or three times I gotta do better, but I saw them, I had to get them. <laughs> Next pair I have are the Dunk Low Michigan. I was on the fence about these. Um, they match my shirt. Um, chosen one apparel, they're dope. Uh, I was on the fence about these, should I get them, should I not, should I get them? I feel like these are a fall staple. Um, I believe Dunks are in trend right now, but I think, again, these are a staple. You can wear them during the fall season, whatever. Um, I got these, I think, last week maybe two weeks ago or something um i love them I had to the next pair i have are blazers these multicolor blazers i got on kids foot locker y'all i got them on kids foot locker but like um uh, for a good price um i can't remember but they're super cute and i just felt like i had you know i had to get them the next pair i have are the nike don't high um football gray which is odd to me because they're not gray they're kind of like a light purple but i thought they were i've worn these a lot um you know styling shoots different things like that i love them i think they're super cute um yeah i can't i, I can't say i had to get them no more because I, I really didn't have to get them but i really like them so i got them next pair i have are the air jordan one excuse me, Fusion Red. Um, a lot of people think these look like Ronald McDonald shoes. I don't think they do. I think they're really cute, especially for women. Um, if you're like trying to get into ones, I think you should start here. They're not a lot. I thought these were gonna be like way over resale, but people think they're ugly. So they're, they're, they got these for a good price, so. Next pair I have are the Air Jordan 1 Mid SE. Uh, 
sneakerheads don't come for me i don't remember what they're called but i've won on sneakers it's the only time i've ever won on sneakers so i had to okay you guys the next pair i have are like a grail for me because kendrick lamar is one of my favorite rappers i got the kendrick lamar um the reebok like and it's so cool that it's like blue and one tongue and red on the other and the back it's like the same way i saw how much these were going for and i was like wow i got these on jimmy jazz i think for like 65 dollars and i was like what a blessing next pair i have are the women's air force one se i thought these were so cute when i got them in like 2018 um, um i've only worn them a few times please don't judge me um i thought they were cute i thought they were really cute i got them on nike.com um they're the only pair of air forces i have i thought they were really nice so next pair i have are the blazer mid 77 in the classic black and white colorway you guys i'm so blessed and so grateful um my brother and my sister they they got me these um for, uh, as a birthday gift i was like i was so hyped because i really wanted them um so yeah i love these with all my heart these might be my favorite in my entire collection the easter dunk low the woman's like i love these so much and i've worn them a lot but again i like to keep my shoes in like good condition even if that means i have to walk like a bird um i love these with all my heart they're they're my personality in a shoe so yeah the next pair i have are the cheetah air max 95. um if i'm being 100 percent honest here um i'm a huge fan of what's good her style on instagram and i've never had a pair of air maxes and i saw the way she styled a pair of air maxes and i was like huh that's like really cool um, and I just went Air Max hunting and I found these and I just had to, had to get them. Um, I've worn them once, I believe. The next pair I have are the Jordan 11 Low Rose Gold. You guys, I got these from Refresh Pittsburgh. They're incredible. They're a sneaker consignment shop in Pittsburgh. You guys, I got these for $60. I couldn't pass them up. I didn't need them, but I, I, I couldn't pass them up. So, yep, here they are. So happy. I've yet to sell them, but that will be coming soon. I lied about the Easter Dunks. These might be my favorite. The Biohack Air Jordan 1. You guys, I got these on finish line. My brother helped me get these. Like, I don't, I don't know what he did online, but he helped me get them. I love these shoes with all my heart. I would, would probably like wear these the rest of my life. I, I wouldn't have any issue and, and some, some other heels, but sneaker wise, I would never take these off. Like I love these so much. I think personally, I think they're one of the best ones. The next pair I have, some people may like, some people may not. Um, They were kind of slept on, but I thought they were very unique. Um, the Air Jordan 6 Retro Denim. Excuse whatever that is in the background. I don't know if that's a cicada. I don't know. But um, I really like them. I've styled them once, but I really think they're cute. I should wear them more often. I will. So, yeah. The next pair I have are the Air Jordan 11. Um, I forgot what they're called. Um, I got these on StockX last year. Um, I've worn them once. The next pair I have are like one of my favorites in my collection. I got these in 2018. I was in Houston. Um, I got them on Flight Club. Um, the Air Jordan 1 Hyper Royal. I These are so unique to me. Um, of course, you could, I could have got like the regular um, ones without like you know the side and stuff like that but i just think these are so cool um it zips over here it zips up like i just think that's so cool to me okay this is the final pair guys i tried to make this as quick as possible 
<laughs> I'm 40. I don't, I don't want it to be like a 20 minute long video. So, um, I have another pair of threes, but I, mind you, I didn't bring all my shoes. These are, there's still some. Um, the Air Jordan 3 Laser Orange. Y'all, I love these so much. I got these on Refresh Pittsburgh for a good price. I'm telling you, like, Refresh Pittsburgh. RefreshPGH.com. Check them out. They have shoes for great prices. I got these. I'm in love with them. I had to get them. Okay, I thought about it. I didn't want to leave you guys hanging. Um, I have other sneakers, but they're not like hype sneakers or... I would put them in a category of miscellaneous, really. Um, but I don't want to leave you hanging. I have two more pair. So I'll just show you these and that'll be it. I wanted to make it quick, painless, and everything. So next up is the Como de Garcon. I got these in 2018. Um, they were a gift. Um, I love them with all my heart. For one, if you give me a gift, I'll cherish it and probably cry about it if I'm being honest with you. I got kind of rain in these. I've I've styled them on numerous occasions. Um I feel like they're a staple for anyone's closet trying to find their personal style. Um they can you can dress them up, you can dress them down, casual, sexy, chic, business casual. Um I love them. So yeah. The final pair I have are the Jordan 7 sweater. I love these as you can see they're worn a lot I love these for a multitude of reasons um I actually um my mom bought these for me when I was in high school crazy I still have shoes <laughs> from like high school I think I was in like 10th grade I can still fit them but um me and my mom we had kind of like this deal that I believe if I got like on a roll or high on a roll or if I just had like a certain grade average um, she would get them for me and she got them for me. I think I got these in what? Foot Locker? Like in the store before there was like, you know, resellers and stuff like that. Um, and I've kept them ever since. And that completes my sneaker collection. Um, and the shirt I'm wearing um, is from Chosen One Apparel. Um, she's amazing. Uh, her business is dope. Just if you can, I'll put the link in the description, you know, to purchase a shirt and to refresh Pittsburgh and social status to, you know, build your collection. Um, it is a blessing to be able to have, you know, be able to purchase and afford sneakers I like. Um, I don't take it for granted. I'm not doing any of this to make anybody feel less than for, you know, what my collection is. Um, I'm just grateful. You know, I love sneakers. I love, incorpor I love incorporating them into my style. Um, Building looks, creating looks, sneakers, heels, bold clothing, bold prints. I've always been a way for me to express myself um, and just really allow me to be myself. It's, it's, it's really a safe space for me, if I'm being honest. Um, so thank you guys for forcing me and like pushing me to do this and step out of my comfort zone. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I uh, hope you liked it. Hopefully you found some sneakers that you might add to your collection. So yeah, you can like and subscribe if you want to. If you don't, that's that's fine, but thanks for tuning in.